It's me, Professor Tree, and today I'll be going over some of the latest leaks for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Let's go! Well, 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 leak seasons is finally upon us. Today we're starting off with some juicy ones though, as up first is a close-up shot of that pirate Pokemon from the other day with the pompadour haircut. And I've gotta say, I really like its design. I will say that I hope it evolves into something bigger and crazier, but only time will tell as the games are right around the corner. Personally, I love, love, love the way the art direction is going with these new Pokemon designs, as they have gone from less flashy designs to make them blend in better with the existing Pokemon in the franchise, and I cannot wait to see what the other Pokemon in this game look like, as so far it's insane how good they look. Next up is this confirmed legitimate screenshot of a Paldean Tauros form, which appears to be all black and has a third eye, potentially hinting at a psychic typing, as that's traditionally where the third eye is depicted in mysticism and other spiritual figures' depictions. I've gotta say, Tauros looks awesome in this shot, and I'm really excited to see what it can do and what its moves are like. Growing up, my favourite episode of the anime was when Ash caught all those Tauros, so it's nice to see this old Pokemon finally getting some love in the franchise. So after what seems like an endless wait, we may finally have screenshots of the middle stage evolution for Hui Coco, the fire type starter. In this image, it shows to be a little bit bigger and with a largely similar colour scheme, but the main change is the addition of a sombrero with what appears to be an egg in the middle on its head. The fan art that I'm about to show you really shows the best possible artwork design for this Pokemon based on this blurry image. Personally, I'm not a huge fan of this evolution. If the image is indeed real, as it kind of feel like Foy Coco had a lot more potential to be a fire ghost dinosaur over this sombrero wearing little dude, but I guess we'll have to see what comes of it when it evolves later on in the game into its final evolution. We have also finally had some brand new Pokemon leak through the Centro Twitter page. We can see that the player who has remained anonymous has shared images of their team. In this photo, we can see two new Pokemon, Flamigo, the Flamingo Pokemon, Tarantulas, the Tarantula Pokemon, and finally a separate image of Dolive, the evolved form of Smolov, and I'm gonna say that this flat out of the gate, I love these Pokemon designs, as they're both charming and cute at the same time, whilst also looking like they can be found in many other regions due to their design language. Another really awesome thing about these Pokemon being leaked is it finally solves some of the famous leaks by Riddle Aku, a famous leaker on Twitter, as it solves a riddle about Smolov being, as he quotes, a waifu Pokemon, as well as a pink bird Pokemon which I'm safe to say is Flamigo. Overall, I'm very excited to see these guys in game and see what they can do. Thanks to this screenshot, the Pokemon Vivion was confirmed for a return in these games, as it's shown inside of the Gym Challenge office looking area where we're introduced to the chairwoman of the Pokemon League for the Paldea region. What I like about this is that Vivion is a very unique Pokemon, as its colours can change depending on where you are in the world, and I'm seriously hoping that awesome mechanic makes a return some way. We can also faintly see in the background an unrevealed frog Pokemon which has yet to have any images leaked of it outside of this blurry screenshot. I personally love frog Pokemon, as I'm crossing my fingers for this guy to be a real change to the Pokemon frog stereotypes we've seen before when it comes to the Pokemon designs. We have also had some artwork leaked online, and I'm gonna say now, just to be safe, we don't know whether this is real or not, and just to be safe or sorry, I'm going to say that it isn't. But in the event that it is, let's break down this design, as so far it looks just like the original breakdown that was scrubbed off the internet weeks ago, and I'm really hoping that it is what it is. Now you're probably thinking, why show us this if it's not confirmed to be legitimate or not, and that's because I think it's fun to speculate about this Pokemon whether or not it's a legitimate leak, as it really has a really unique design, and I think it could be really cool if it is actually actually the final evolution. Now before we get on to the craziest and final bombshell of the leaks in this video, I'd first like to discuss a theory that's been brewing on the internet, and that theory is centered around the rather large crater in the middle of the region, and its possible connection to Carlos and the ultimate weapon. As many people have stated before, geographically, since Carlos is based on France and Paldea is based on Spain and the Iberian Peninsula, they are connected by land, and I personally think that that's why we have so many shared building styles with Carlos and Paldea, when you look at the modern and medieval buildings in the region. I personally believe that the center of the region's crater was made by the ultimate weapon during the war between Carlos and presumably Paldea, as this crater is rather big and replicates the designs of other craters created by the ultimate weapon in the series. Another thing we know about the ultimate weapon is that it had its hand in making mega stones, which are also another form of crystal, very similar to the terrestrializing mechanic, so potentially these two are connected and maybe terrestrializing is either the perfected version or the final version of Mega Evolution. And I personally think that the third legendary of these games, which is rumored to reside in the crater, could indeed be Zygarde. Now before you click off the video, hear me out. There are three dragons and it would fit really well, as Coridon protects the past, Maridon protects the future, and Zygarde protects the present, as it would be rather fitting to have a way to explain the game into a DLC where we either explore seven colors or the entirety of colors as post-game slash DLC content. 
Now finally, the craziest of these leaks, a complete-ish list of the Pokedex and names and typings of various starter Pokemon for the games. Because there are so many Pokemon, I'm going to pick out a few important mentions and the main ones being the evolved forms of the starters, in this case being Sprigatito into Getrixie, finally into Calaquin. What's interesting about this is there's a common theme of being a trickster in this Pokemon's name, and it looks as though Sprigatito is going to evolve into a dark grass combo with a jester-like appearance based on its name. Next up is the evolution line for my boy Fue Coco. This line progresses from Fue Coco to Crocolaw and then finally onto Lullagator, the Fire Ghost type. What's interesting about this name progression is it appears to be evolving into a alligator instead of a dinosaur like a lot of the community thought it was going to. And you know, I was here thinking it was going to be a Spinosaur. Overall, I'm interested to see how it looks and I can't wait to see it in game. And finally, onto Donald Duck himself, Quaxley. Quaxley evolves into Quaffare and finally into Quaxalance. Now, unfortunately, unlike the previous Pokemon names, this Pokemon is rather confusing to theorize about based on its final evolution being water fighting. I'm hoping that it will be a martial artist style design for this Pokemon, with maybe some flowing hair and feathers to make some sort of tassels or ropes, potentially. Unfortunately, that's all for me today, trainers, but I will show you the list on screen so you can pause and have a read through. But take everything as I've said with a pinch of salt, as any of the leagues can be inaccurate or some can be completely fake. But only time will tell on November 18th. Until then, keep on catching!